So you're thinking about moving to Yorba Belinda, Yorba Belinda is great, but it's not for everybody. So in this video, I'm gonna give you a few of the reasons why I think that you should not move to Yorba Belinda. So number one, the nightlife is just not that good in Yorba Belinda. There are some things to do, but the nightlife is a little bit sleepy. Just one city over, basically on the border of Yorba Belinda is Placentia. There's a couple spots there that people love to go to like Kelly's or Rem's, which is now an 80s bar. But the nightlife in general, there's just not too much going on. You know, there is, the new uh, Main Street, you know, with Clyde's and Terra. There's Lone Wolf. There's also Oceans and Earth. So there are some things to do, but just not very lively. So for a while, we've been hoping here, the residents of Yorba Belinda, that we'd get some more dining options, some more nightlife options and stuff like that. So they are revamping Main Street. I hear that they are putting in some more restaurants on Main Street right now, so that's gonna be really good. What I think is also really cool, and I know I've talked about it a couple of times, is that rooftop bar at Clyde's. It's a separate restaurant besides Clyde's. It's got full bar, beautiful views, TVs. But overall, the nightlife in Yorba Belinda is just a little bit more chill. The second reason why you should not move to Yorba Belinda would be the cost of living. So mostly with the home prices, but I guess that's like that with the majority of cities here in Southern California. The Yorba Belinda real estate market can get a little bit expensive though. The housing market here is highly sought after with its big lots, equestrian properties, and private communities, and the super, super safe community. Yorba Belinda was ranked the third safest city in the entire state of California. It's a great place to live, it's a great place to raise a family, but it does come with a higher price tag. The lowest priced home in Yorba Belinda is $555,000 and it's a condo. The highest price is an estate that's $6.5 million. So the average days on the market here in Yorba Belinda is just 25 days, so that's telling you it's desirable because homes are selling fast. All right, so location. So the number three reason to not move to Yorba Belinda is the location. We are in North Orange County, probably the most north city in all of Orange County before we hit Riverside County, furthest away from the beach. So we're about 30, 35 minutes depending on traffic. So that means it does get a little bit warmer. And if you don't work in or super close to Yorba Linda and you're a commuter, you are gonna be dealing with that 91 traffic that 55 traffic. So location is gonna be one of the reasons why maybe you'd wanna reconsider moving to Yorba Belinda. All right, so that's it. Those are the three reasons why you should not move to Yorba Belinda. I hope you found this video useful, gave you some good information. Please do me a favor, subscribe to my channel, me for anything, have any questions about the market, about real estate, all my information is gonna be right below. Please don't hesitate to ever contact me directly. I will always get back to you.